happened. This is Amit and you are at my channel Information and Educational Video. Here is the important update regarding the CSAB counseling that is the round one allotment has been done now. So please try to listen my word. There are many students who have got the seat at very high rank as they have got the feedback from the students. So please try to check your allotment and try to comment down your allotment whatever you got and what is your rank and your category as well. And also the important thing is that what you need to do now. So obviously there are five type of uh, there are five type of decision making that you need to do that is freeze, float, slide and also there is surrender and uh, withdraw and surrender and participate in second round of the counseling. So what is the meaning of everything? I would like to inform you freeze means you will take the final admission and once and one thing also I would like to remind you again that is if you have got any type of seat and you have an earlier seat in JOSA also that seat is gone now you can't take that seat again. So please try to keep in your mind you can't take that seat but now if you haven't got anything and if you have the fear that in next round I can get the other seat that is that I don't want then you need to just do surrender and withdraw your previous seat will be with you. So please try to keep this thing in your mind otherwise you may lose the better seat and you will get the less deserving seat. So now let's discuss about the decision making freeze means you will take the admission and next slide means you will take the same college but with other branches if possible from your choice filling and float means you also know better branches better college whatever possibilities above your choices whatever you got now you will be getting in the upcoming round if possible and surrender and withdraw means you will not take the admission in currently allotted seat and also your previous seat has been calcium means you will not take the admission in any of the NIT triple IT GFT whatever you got and surrender and participate in upcoming round means as of now you don't have any seat whatever you got you will withdraw, uh, you will not take that and you will look for better seat in the upcoming round if if there will be any type of seat you will be getting the admission in that so this one more important information i would like to inform you that is the online reporting all those students who have done the online reporting in josa counseling you don't need to do here again and if you have got the seat for the first time you need to do the same thing that is document upload class 10 class 12 and your class 12 marks it again in place of a state code of eligibility and your medical certificate and your category certificate if applicable so this this type of thing you need to do and that needs to be done as soon as possible because last date is first of november so try to do it very carefully otherwise you may face the problem and also if you need complete counseling guidance regarding the decision making or you should take the seat in whatever you got or not or you should take the admission in other college if you have got bits or jack delhi counseling colleges or comet k colleges so everything i will discuss with you once you register with my guidance there is a very nominal charge for that once you register i will try to discuss everything with you and if possible with your parents so that you will not do any type of mistake and you will able to join the best otherwise you may have to regret later right so this was the complete information regarding the spot on the counseling it is first round of a spot counseling has been done now please try to make your mind because you have to do it up to up to uh, first of november it is day after tomorrow because on second of november there will be again the second round of the counseling after that from 4th of november up to 9th of november you need to uh, reach to the college that is some college will be doing physical reporting some will be doing online reporting so accordingly you need to do the uh, reporting and you will have to finalize your admission by paying the remaining amount whatever uh, whatever left so, so one thing also i would like to inform you here that is they will ask you for the other payment that is if you have got the seat you have to pay 37000 more that is 38000 you already paid either in josa counseling or in the csab counseling during the participation but now you have to pay 37000 for general obc ws i am talking about for SC, ST, PWD is this 17,000. So hope you get this information very useful for you. So please try to subscribe to the channel so that you will be getting all the updated information at the right time in the same channel. Thanks.